Hello, in this video I would like to give you some tips on how to improve your workflow for marking or grading homework, in particular when your students don't use Google Drive themselves. Marking homework in Google Drive is a two-step process. First, you have to get your students' files into Drive and then you have to mark and send them back to your students. The first step is to get your students' files into your Google Drive. This can be done in various ways. You can use Gmail to save files directly into a homework folder in your drive. It is also possible to automate this process by using the Send to Google Drive script, which runs in a Google spreadsheet. In this script, you have to specify a Gmail label, which you have to create in Gmail itself. The script saves all attachments from emails with that label to a Google Drive folder, which you specify. I simply use homework. The last entry in the setup file tells the script which Gmail label to apply to show you that the files have been saved to your drive. All you need to do then is to authorize and run the script which will work in the background. For further information go to the developers page where you can also get a copy of the script. Another option is to use an external upload form like Drop Zone or Form Plus. I use Form Plus, which you can install from the Chrome Web Store for free, as it is ad sponsored. You can create an upload form for your students and share the link via email with your students. Once your students' files are in your drive, you can start marking the homework and send it back to your students. I have moved the Form Plus submission folder inside my homework folder. You can convert a file to Google Docs format by right-clicking and opening in Google Docs. Marking can be done either using Command or the new track changes add-on, which works similar to the same function in Microsoft Word. Make sure you have got the highlight my new changes checkbox checked. When done, you just share the file with the student who handed it in. I usually use a different option. I synchronize the homework folder in my Google Drive with the Drive folder on my Windows desktop. When I want to mark homework, I go to the folder in Explorer and sort by date. I start marking files from the top and when it has been marked, it moves automatically to the bottom as it is now the last modified file. Then I simply mark the homework using the track changes function in Microsoft Word. Immediately after marking a student's work, I send it back via Gmail. When sending the file back to the student, I use the reverse chronological order so that the student's file shows up at the top in Explorer. I find this the most convenient and efficient workflow for marking homework. I hope you've enjoyed the video. 